स्टैंडर्ड थर्ड सब्जेक्ट ईवीएस लेसन नंबर एट आ नीड फॉर वॉटर पार्ट टू इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ वॉटर वॉटर इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट रिसोर्स ऑन द प्लानिट विदाउट वॉटर लाइफ के नॉट एग्जिस्ट Rain is a main source of fresh water. Rain falls on the ground and gets collected in lakes and ponds. When it flows, it forms small streams and then big rivers. These are known as fresh water bodies. Sometimes the rain water seeps through the ground and gets collected on the ground. This water is called as ground water. we can reach this water by digging wells water pumps and hand pumps we have man made sources like dams and canals for collecting and distributing water water plays an important role in digestion of food water is necessary for irrigation of crops and is integral part of an agriculture humans make use of water for a wide range of domestic activities such as washing them and cleaning them many industries require large quantity of water for processing cooling and diluting the products they need water for almost every step of their process Water gets polluted because of the waste from factories. Daily activities are incomplete without water, such as clothing, bathing, drinking, cleaning, cooking, etc. Therefore, we can see how not only human beings but plants and animals too require water. the earth depends on water to function people need water not only for drinking but also for cooking and cleaning we need water for agriculture and industries as well water is very important in our life children now let us try out one activity children take two potted plants of equal growth label them as 1 and 2 every morning for the next 5 days water only plant 1 do not water plant 2 children what do you see yes plant 2 which was not watered slowly dried up Plant one looks fresh and green. Children, what does this tells us? Yes, this tells us that plants need water to live. Without water, they cannot live. Plants too need water. Plants have specific needs like light, air, water. nutrients and space almost all plants need these five things to survive light plants usually get the light that they need from the sun plants use light as their energy if a plant does not receive enough light it will grow very slowly but too much of light can cause the plant and the soil it leaves to dry out different plants have different light requirements some need bright light and some need direct light air air contains many gases they includes nitrogen oxygen carbon dioxide and water vapors water plants need water 
water has been absorbed by the roots water travels through the plant stems to the leaves water also helps to move nutrients from the soil into the plant too much of water can cause a plant's roots to rot nutrients nutrients are the substances that nourishes a plants when nutrients dissolve in water the roots absorb the nutrients if a plant cannot get the nutrients it needs from the soil fertilizers can help fertilizers provide plants with essential nutrients helps them to grow faster space to grow all living things need space a plant's roots need space so that they can spread out and absorb water and nutrients its leaves need space so that they can access light we water our potted plants farmers water the crops in the field could this plants live without water thus we see that plants like animals need water too some plants like lotus grow only in water we can try our best to grow them in to the soil but they cannot survive there they only grow in water i hope children you enjoyed it thank you